your host for today's podcast of the Seven Stages and whatever, blah, blah, blah. Anyways, I'm joined by Impa Dude. Hi. Dude, Jeremy Luigi. Hey. Mr. Sushi. Suck my dick! <gasps> and MK King. Pussy pickles. <laughs> Anyways, today's topic is going to be on Earthbound, because I like it so much, so deal with it. Anyways, the first question is, which was your favorite Earthbound game in the series and why? And Impidude is going first. Oh, for God's sakes, okay. My uh, favorite uh, Mother game was... I, I never played the Mother series, so I, I can't answer that question, I'm sorry. Um, is that it? Yeah. Give a pun. Give a pun. Oh, okay. crap. Pun, pun, pun. Uh, knock, knock. Who's there? Doctor. <laughs> Doctor. <laughs> yeah, see? <laughs> That's the cheesiest Okay. <laughs> next person. Okay. You're next. At least you played one. Yeah. MK King. Um, I've never played one, but I'd probably which, which is a. Shit, they broke up. Oh, I might pick that one up eventually. Um. Dreamy. Okay. Two Dreamy Luigi. Uh. Father is my favorite Earthbound game because it has opposite genders and features a dark and well-crafted story. Father doesn't exist. So I'm making it my own series. You know what? Good I'm, for I'm you. I'm just kidding. I never played it. <laughs> hey. Deal with it. Okay. Uh, well, my turn. I like Mother 3 because of all the feels in that game. It feels so real and it's really sad. You feel the feel. Yeah, I'm really feeling it. Guys, you sa- you sound so like glitchy. Yeah, you all sound really bad to me as well. Really? Yeah. I can barely hear you. You need to play more, Father. Um. Anyway, you want me to go into the second question? Yeah. Which Earthbound Mother character would you like to see in the next Smash if they make one another one? They will definitely make another one. They probably won't. It's... Right. Okay, okay, I don't... I know, I know, alright? If, if I'm wrong, I'm wrong. You don't have to tell me the facts. I know the facts. Wait, it's my turn? Yeah! Oh! Which was your... Fr- okay, uh, wait. Which are found... Uh, I don't know. Maybe, like, Paula, because, like, she's a female. We need more female Smash representation. Yeah, we you do. We're fine without. We're fine. No, we're never not fine. Not being with... sexist or anything, but like, I mean, yeah, Paula's pretty awesome, but like, add the cool characters before the female characters. Like, well, anyways, probably... I... yeah, okay. Let me know what Mr. Sushi's gonna say. Oh, are you done, Jimmy? Yeah, I'm done. All right. Uh, well, they should bring Lucas back, of course, but as a newcomer, they should totally put in Kumatora. Cause yes, boss ass bitch, bitch, bitch. Sushi. Yeah. Love her. Stop cussing. Just um, the one who runs his fucking mouth all the time. Wow. Okay. Way to be a right. Can we go on to the next person? Yeah. MK King. Uh. I'd probably go for Lucas. Um, I just want him back in, instead, really. I don't really know many of the other characters. I might like to see a villain, um, because I don't think we get enough villains in Smash, um, so that might be something I'd want to see, but so far, basically, just Lucas. Okay. Do you Jeremy Luigi? Pooh. I want Pooh back in. I want Earthbound Krillin back. <laughs> he, he kicks butt. Yeah, especially with PK Starstorm. But, um, I like to see Lucas back as well for obvious reasons. And I like to see Maskman just because we need another Earthbound. Well, we need a villain, I mean. And Maskman is really awesome. Yeah. 
Uh, wait, what? What are your opinions of Lucas not being in Smash 4? I mean, I guess, like, uh, it's a little sad, you know, because he was a cool character and everything, but, like, I literally don't really care that much because I wasn't really that big of a Lucas player, so, yeah. And he was really good. Um, Mr. Sushi. Um... Uh, I mean, I can see why they didn't do it for, like, more space, I guess, for other characters. But then again, did we really need Dr. Mario? No. Exactly. <laughs> but he's really good. But, I mean, I wasn't too affected by it at first because I have never played Brawl. But then I finally played it and I was like, why the fuck is this bitch? Oh, I'm sorry. Pardon me. <laughs> um, that's it. Is it? Is it? Oh, is it my turn? Okay. Yep. Uh, um. Yeah. I. I think he should be back. Honestly. Um. I think they did definitely have enough space. You know, they can fit Dark in, and they can fit Doctor Mario, and they can fit Lucas. I mean, I kind of get it. Why the Ice Climbers? Because they were like a duo, and they couldn't fit them in the 3 yes version. There were some technical issues. But Lucas, he's a he's a one person. He should have definitely been back in the game. Which is pretty good, so I'm not too, you know, pissed off with it. Um, but yeah, I, I would have liked to see Lucas back. That's madness. Um, yeah. Future me, Luigi. Uh, I'm I'm not too sad about Lucas Lucas not appearing in Smash Four. Sakurai either had to put Ness or Lucas in, regardless. He chose Ness because I assume Ness is more memorable than Lucas. And also, he's part I of the original. He's well. in the original game. Yeah. So yeah. Oh, okay. Lucas <laughs> suffered from the same fate as Wolf. And yeah. that's it. To be honest, I wasn't really... Oh, Dom, are you still... Uh, I'm finished. Oh. Um, to be honest, I was a really good Wolf player, but I never wanted him back. <laughs> I was kind of biased on that. But I do really want Lucas in because it's Lucas! It's Lucas. He suffered a lot in Mother 3. He should come back. Lucas! Yep. Okay, so question number four. If you can make a PSI move, PK Fire, PSI Magnet, etc., um, what would it what would it be and what would it do? Oh god, wait, do I have to go for <laughs> Oh, there's like a variety of choices you could choose from this. I mean you could either do, like, a really happy one or, like, one that's just kind of like, oh, well, that would be cool. Um, I guess I would do PK, um, can, can you come back to me, please? <laughs> I haven't quite thought this one through. PK Triforce? Huh, you, uh, no, uh, PK... I'm trying to think about this one. No, right. I have a, Yeah, go to sushi. Okay, you might hear popcorn popping down because I'm a fat ass and I needed some. So I'll just make this fast. I really want PK selfie, and it blinds them with the flash of the selfie. Of course you would choose that one. You were just playing the song, like, earlier. <laughs> Could it use that as an outro? Never mind. I'm okay, King. Oh, okay. Um, I'd use PK Self Destruction, um, where it just blows up like everything, uh, like our PK Nuke. Um, so like the, the bad guys would just like instantly die. I mean, or PK Suicide Bomber. Oh, okay. I have one. Guys, I have one. Two Jimmy Luigi. Oh, okay. Don't listen to me yet. Um, if I could make a PSI move, I w it would be called PSI Virus. This ability can be used to simply break the game. Screw video game logic. I could glitch through the game like a madman, corrupt everything. That would be something that Geigers would call screw you. <laughs> uh, he'll be, he'll be, okay, yeah, yeah. All right, wait, can I go? Can I go now? I have my I have my thing. Oh, sure, Jimmy. Okay, so it's called PK Spirit. 
Oh, great. I'm sure they probably made this one of the games, so it'll probably suck. But, like, where, like, your own, like, soul or spirit sneaks up on the enemies because they don't, they can't see the spirit, and then it, like, slits their throat. No, uh, they didn't make that. That's pretty cool. Yeah. That's pretty terrifying. Yeah. Did you get that from Spirit Temple? No. Okay. Um, I'd probably make up a move PK win, where basically it's just a win attack, where if it, it's a, it's a 60 or 70% chance that it might, like 70 out of 30, it might blow your opponent off. Uh, sorry, I was putting away balls. Instantly win. Yeah, it could also hurt people too. Basically, you create a tornado. All that hustle for a freaking 1-800 number. Dead. <laughs> <laughs> I fucking dropped a bolt. Sorry, pardon my language. Okay. Now, the last question, question number five, is do you think the Earthbound Mother series deserves a Mother 4? Not really, because, like, well, I mean, it sure it does deserve one, but would I play it? No. Because I'm not really interested in the series. Because you suck. Although, wow, okay, thanks, Dreamy. <laughs> Dreamy, Dreamy's getting a little sassy today. No, actually, I mean, I guess I could give it a shot because I did do the same thing with Legend of Zelda, so there's always a chance that I would play Well, it. that's your preference. <laughs> okay. I'm, I'm good. Got my popcorn, so I'm ready for this. Um, yeah, it totally deserves one, Mother 4. It would be totally awesome. So yeah, that's for totally make it. MK King. All right. Um. Yeah, I'd, I'd definitely like to see a mother four. I think like Nintendo like keeps like just Mario and Zelda. Um. I don't like that. I want to see more IPs get into um the franchise. So I'd, I'd definitely like to see a mother four game. Um. Would I play it? Yeah, I'd, I'd give it a go. It's a new mother game. It would, it would probably have some new graphics, etc. Um. So definitely, I think. There's a few lost mother fans out there that would love to see another game. So, yeah, definitely. Okay, two Jimmy Luigi. I think the Earthbound slash Mother series deserves a Mother 4. I highly doubt it because you know how Nintendo is is with Milk and Mario, Legend of Zelda, and Kirby through their others, as weird as that sounds. But depending on how much fan service from the Earthbound community, we might, just might get what they wanted for a long time. Just make it to where the gameplay is fun and have some features that cater to first-time players and experienced players. It has potential, but the only way to truly create the Earthbound game is by making a complicated fan game. Okay. Um, my turn? Well, of course I want a Mother 4. Well, it would be a nice... It would be like a fresh start to the Mother series again, but this time with current players, like new generation people. And it could work it could work really great. Well similar to a link between worlds did where it brought back Link. Okay. It could do the same thing with Earth Phone. Right. Can it have modern media? Yep. Okay. Okay, but so yeah, that's what I think. I hope they make a Mother 4 in the future. Please, Nintendo, consider it. Yeah, I don't want it to become like a Half-Life 3 thing. Oh. Which is like a joke in the end. Yeah. So, yeah. Maybe Mother 4 will become a joke. <laughs> no. Mother 4 confirmed. <laughs> yeah, it, it kind of already has. But, yeah. It's still Mother 4 Um, yeah, I mean, I pretty, I think that's it. Pretty much. Yeah. Yeah. So, sorry that it is. So. Oh my god, guys. Oh my god. Mother yeah. has six letters, and and there are over two mother games, mm. and six divided by two is three, which means. Oh god. Oh god. Sushi, oh couldn't you just said that the sushi? Sushi, couldn't you just said that there's three mother games? I said there's over two. I know, but if you said that there's just three, three is the Illuminati. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> it does exist. Is that pretty much? Was that you, King? No. What? I was about to say. Sounded really different. Uh. 
Yeah, it was me. I miss Sea Slug. Who here misses Sea Slug? I miss Sea Slug. I I do. Where is he? I do. I have baby with him. He said he'd take a nap, and I think he's still sleeping. No, but seriously, like, where is he? I have no idea. He's under Gary's shell. Dude, that's deep. Yeah. (laughs) Okay, before we wrap this up, I just want to mention, if you didn't already know, The Seven Sages has... Oh my. It has its own website right now, and so you can go check it out, and then... Yeah, yeah feel free to it. check it's the... It's pretty dull at the moment, but yeah. it might get better. Yeah, be so, sure to check out the wonderful nothingness that's on that site. Well, there's well, stuff I think, I, think we, I think we should apologize for, like, the gaps in between um, people speaking here, but, yeah, sorry about the that. The episode was actually one of the shortest episodes we've had. It was, like, literally only 15 minutes. Well, because we're right. longer. Honest question. Okay, how about everyone gives a pun? Okay. Well, I'll try to think of one. Alright, here's my pun. Actually, you know what? I'll save mine for later. Okay, here's mine. I don't know one. <laughs> oh, what's brown and sticky? Poo. God. Uh, it's brown. You're, you're glitching up. Well. Thanks, guys. That was wonderful sushi's pun that I did. But forever, do you want to wrap this up? Or? I could not hear you guys at all. Yeah. Yeah. I can't yeah. Remember. Okay, well, I mean, I'll tell my pun. So, once upon a time, there was a wonderful princess. That's so funny. Shut up! <laughs> it's story time. It's story time with Impa Dude. Okay. Anyways, oh, once. Sh- once upon a time, there was a wonderful princess, and there was a prince, and spoiler alert, the prince dies. Uh, and so anyways, the prince and the princess go to watch a Br- um, the American Revolutionary War um, battle, like a reenactment. Spoiler alert, the British uh, lose. Um, Anyways, so anyway, uh, so they're like watching this reenactment. All of a sudden, the prince is like, "Hey, I mean, you want to have a kid?" And, I, and the princess was like, uh, "No, uh, 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 no." And so he's like, "Well, girl, I'm gonna have a kid because like we we have to keep this we have to keep this generation going." And she and then uh, you know she was all like, "No, no, we end it here. I'm gonna be the new Queen Elizabeth the first. I'm gonna screw up our line, our bloodline." And so he was like, oh, okay, all right, well, bye. And then so he left, and then he got hit by a bus, and then that bus got hit by an airplane, and then that airplane got eaten by a giant whale. And so that whale came to the princess and was like, hey, I killed your husband. And she was like, oh, good. And then she, like, married the whale, and they had a little whale baby. And then at the end, the dude just said, I could give less of a F. Is that even a pun? No. Uh, Alright guys, thanks so much for watching. We'll see you next wait, week. Hey,